listen to that sound. That is so eerie. Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and we're starting on more of a somber note this episode, because we have got a poison ship to take care of. And no, we don't have any IEDs. So <laughs> we're going to have to try and do this the old-fashioned way, with bullets. Ha! Ah, here's a design that I came up with. <clears throat> kind of run through the, uh, the rationale here. As soon as someone shoots this thing, pops out of it mechanoids. Whether caterpillars or scythers or... I don't, I don't remember if there's a third choice. Um, the traditional way that I usually see this done is a whole bank of turrets out here and sandbags and places to stand behind, line up all of your colonists flip a switch, turrets turn on, bang, 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 all the enemies pop out, and we just have ourselves a good old-fashioned shootout. And some of the colonists survive, typically, maybe, and then you kind of go on from there. I'm going to try something that hopefully keeps all of these names in the game for a little bit longer. Um... What I have seen, I've never actually done this before, so this is going to be an experiment, is that a person standing diagonal in this configuration can still tap through with a melee weapon. I don't know if they can shoot through. I think the shooting would hit the blocks and destroy them. But a melee weapon would go through and start tapping away at us. So if we had four people, our, our melee brute squad, out here <clears throat> working away at it, they will, the, the, the mechanoids will jump out and they will not leave their ship to follow us into the gauntlets and, and into the, you know, the turrets over here and all that until the ship drops below 50% hit points. Once it's mostly damaged, then they will abandon it to go and, and uh, to attack whoever harmed their ship. So we have to get this down below 50% in order to get it any advantage out of our defenses over here. Of course, we have to be able to get from here to there as well. So I've seen these guys come out and in 10 seconds work through their first section of wall and they're out. So we need a, something to distract them a bit. If something attacks them, they will attack back. So we get a couple of turrets down here and I was just going to throw a wall across this end right here and just make them come out here. But I don't know what happens if the game decides it wants to kick them out the side and there's an obstacle. Will it kick them beyond the obstacle and suddenly they're out here loose? That I don't know. So I'm going to roll the dice on two sides that are sealed and two sides that are open to give them you know, a 50-50 chance they're going to land inside the barrier somewhere. I left two walls or two wall sections open so that our people can go in and build and then leave. This isn't going to give me much time. Before long, there's going to be a foggy poison cloud starting to form out here. So we got to get right on this. That's why I'm paused while I'm doing all this talking. So, and then we've got power right here. So a switch will keep the system off until we're ready because as soon as this comes live, it's going to detect an enemy and start popping and suddenly we're going to have enemies in here before we're ready for them. So we're not going to throw the switch until everything's done. Thankfully, we have got some... Oh, that, that noise is gone. Huh. We've got some, uh, some iron, some steel. There... None of it here, though, so it's all still far away. So we've got to go get it. So... Before I started up, I sat here and stared at this for a while. Picked our four best builders to make that their first priority. We've got a couple of haulers, Klaus and Ronnie, which also have the fibrous mechanitis, which has caused us problems and has also given us some huge benefits with the enhanced manipulation and moving. So got those two set to haul because we still have all of this food to get in and all of this wood that is breaking down out there so we got to get all that hauled in so I'll have them do the hauling we, we need 
Dwayne to lock on to the idea of cutting blocks. And I need... I wanted to use... What was it? Granite. We've only got 98. It's 15 per, so we're going to go through this really fast. So, question is, how much granite is available right now? If I were to head over here and double click on that, right there, I got nothing in here. That is all sandstone and marble, right? Yeah. We've cleaned all the granite out of within easy walking distance. That's granite there, right? Marble. Okay, so that's a marble. So where are we getting granite from? Your granite over here. But nothing over here is granite. It's marble and sandstone. Okay. So we need to haul this stuff in. So let's go back to the zoom out quite a ways. Back to the table. Bills. Details. And let's set this radius a little bit further out now. And it goes away. Is it because it's out of my view? I don't know why. Are we hitting... We're hitting the edge of the map where you cannot access. That must be what's going on. Hello. We've got a new bear. Grizzly bear, four years old, female. Very healthy. Good biting power. Mm hmm. So another grizzly has entered the map. I'll have to pop around here later and see if we have any uh, cougars that have come back in. So we need to make granite blocks to do this because granite will have the strongest uh, hit point value in a completed wall I believe that's why I'm choosing that um one thing I don't know what is the okay, here's granite hit points 595 what's a granite door have granite door hit points 425 okay so it's best not to use doors for this we'll just bust our way in afterward if we have to Hopefully, we have to. <clears throat> okay. Well, let's get this rolling. We're going to see a fog starting to form here soon. Michael went straight to work down here. He's playing with Fuzzy over here, Fuzzy Wuzzy, who is not hungry right now, so not a problem. In fact, maybe they'll bond and... and uh, We'll have a we'll have a, a serious friendship there. I wonder if there's any nothing comes up around being around somebody. Okay. Yeah. So we'll just have to keep an eye on him. I don't think that distance is going to go away in one episode. I don't think. I think that's about an episode's worth. So we should be fine. <clears throat> okay. Most everyone's sleeping. No, they are starting to roam. In that case, Eric, you're doing what? Hauling steel to conduit. So you're set to build. Let's have you build this switch first. That way we can get that turned off so it doesn't accidentally turn on on us. So the other builders. Klaus is hauling. He's hauling wood. Good. In fact, wood must be the closest thing now. Everything inside has been hauled. That's good news. Who else is out here before they start moving around on me? Kathra is set to hauling. She's hauling kibble. Uh, maybe she made kibble? Don't know. But let's have you next come down. Actually, what is Catherine set for? She is set for hauling and cleaning primarily right now. And actually cleaning is probably what's needed the most. It's getting really rough in there. But let's have you do just one trip of hauling. Uh, gotta get you back. You were in this area right there. One trip of steel would really help us out. Haul that. All right, Nettie is busy building, and let's have you instead concentrate your building time right here. I can't get a hold of that, can I? So let's go for this one. Really? You will not let me click on this wall to build it. Why is that? I can only click on... I can click on the sandbags. Okay, we'll get that going then. And turrets. I've got to get those up and running early before all the walls are in. 
Okay. Brand, you are a builder too? Brand, yes. So let's have you come out. You're still clicked, right? Can I get you to bring this stuff? Yeah, granite wall. That is strange that Nettie wouldn't do that. Hmm. Cancel conduit. There. So Eric is going for uh, steel. Hopefully he grabs more than just the 35. Alright, who was the other builder? Dwayne is hauling sandstone chunk to dumping. Hauling marble. Um, okay, Dwayne, let's have you... Cannot... Materials needed. Oh, because we're still set for that radius. Okay, bills, let's get that taken care of. Uh, detail, no limit. And if I were to tell you to work on this right now, we'll not do it. Now? I don't know why. Okay, well let's just have you then haul this. Bring it in closer. Um, let's set up another stockpile. Let's do that. Zone dumping pile. That'll work too. Right there. Let's do all of that. And you are the chunks granite only. Let's set this one. Oh, wait. This one, copy, paste, paste. All right, so he's going to drop that off there and then go right to work. Okay, so all three of these will only be granite chunks now. All right, that works much better, except I thought I just saw limestone. No, chunk, granite, okay. All right, so Nettie is bringing all that in. Actually, instead of building, if I could just have you guys haul all the stuff over, you'll automatically come back and build. So let's do that and that. Eric, get you to drop this stuff off. Good. And then let's have you bring in all of that. So that's one, two, three. Now, that was Nettie. Where is Ronnie? She's sleeping. Klaus is sleeping. So my other two good runners are out of uh, out of commission right now. You are on your way to get the next granite chunk. Okay, so you will keep this going. Granite is down to 20. Ouch. Okay. How are we going to make this happen a little bit faster? Probably need a second table. Where do we want that second table? This one really doesn't belong here. I would love to have more like a pool table right there or something. Kind of well, if not here, somewhere nearby needs to become more of a um, of a common room, a gathering area. So that's the new hospital. Set as medical. Okay, we're getting there. We kind of left this here last time. And that's going to be for granted, isn't it? It is, but let's just do it. So that is there. And... This is all indoors and secure, so that can go away. Destruct this. Eventually, destruct most of this. I just haven't had a chance to really think about the layout here. You know, even this can go away and be shortened. Trade from... A trader from Grey Mouse Cambrere is coming in. From over here. Okay. And you brought your own boomalopes, huh? You did. <laughs> well... If they're not too expensive, there's insurance right there. <clears throat> bug insurance. Bug bombs. Now, I was brought up the idea of tossing a boomalope in here and roofing this thing over. And that's not an impossibility. It will burn up and destroy everything. But And one advantage that we've got is this is still off of 13. Roofs build instantly. And they unbuild instantly. We could light this whole thing on fire, kill the bad guys, take the roofs off and everything in the fire will go out or they can put the fire out but that feels a little bit too cheaty to me that's not realistic 
You know, realistically, we could have built something with a gap up against the ship to where they can't get to the gap. So this is not so much unrealistic. But making the roof disappear just to, uh, uh, to pull that off, that doesn't feel like enough of a challenge. So we won't do that. Um... I wonder what is more cover, these sandbags or these stone blocks? Hmm. And we could put up some wood wall posts to stand next to. Hmm. Like here and here. You know, I kind of like that idea. It's something I've seen Cathra use, and it uh, it works really effectively. Let's security sandbag. <clears throat> well, sandbag or blocks. I like to save the iron if I can. You can see the fog starting to form here. So how do we tell? I'm trying to remember how that was done. Almost need to put someone behind a block have someone else aim at them and then see what the the cover rating is. I think that's the way it's got to be done in order to... it's not something that I can just click on and have a cover rating show up. It doesn't work that way. It's got to be used as cover and then then rated at that point. Hmm. Another, issue, <clears throat> another issue we've got here is that uh, this is going to eventually start letting off some psychic signals, which is going to turn all the animals into crazed animals and manhunters. Right now, there's nothing here but maybe a squirrel or a bunny, so... But we've seen how dangerous those can be. Hopefully, there are no turtles over here. Oh, turtles. Okay, you are good. I needed this mined out, so these two standing here have a way to get out and around should they immediately try to come through. Um, so I'm assuming everybody's up and they're all building other things. We're going to have to manually keep these guys going. So come on over and build that. And Brand, come on over and build that. Nettie, sleeping. And the fourth one, Brand, Rokes, Eric. Eric is sleeping. Okay. That is fine. Is anybody else up, though, that could just haul supplies over? Klaus is up. Playing horseshoes with Vapa, right? Yeah. I will have both of you guys quickly haul over some... What? Have you guys haul granite blocks back? That'd be a good thing. Rabbit is feeding somebody. Okay. Rokes, Brand, you guys are still here. I thought somebody escaped. Nettie, you are... Consuming a fine meal. That's a good idea. Busy day ahead of us. Ronnie, you're playing chess. All right, everybody get your happiness up because it's not going to be happy later. All right, Ronnie is hauling marble to stockpile. No, you're going to haul granite to stockpile. Run. Now, you guys. Kathra, you are consuming a fine meal. As soon as Nettie's loose, there you are. You think you're building wood floors. Instead, you are building an improvised turret. And Rabbit thinks he's cooking a fine meal, but he is going to haul in another granite chunk. That's why I have everybody set to at least a four on, on the most important things, so that spur of the moment I can have someone just go and mine something even though they're not skilled at it so I, everybody is capable of going over and hauling something spur of the moment without having to enable it later you are consuming a fine meal oh why didn't you do that before all right vapor what are you doing sewing area that's important too but we have to survive it first what's left <clears throat> let's get another granite chunk in right there and that should keep Dwayne working. Where is Dwayne anyway? 
He's not here. Work, Dwayne. He is, he's sleeping. I went to the, looked in the wrong place. All right, Klaus, you are now hauling in a granite chunk. And that may be enough granite blocks to get this job done. Michael is doing that and he's finished. Can you need materials? Okay. Can you haul in a granite chunk? Hey, Dwayne, how you doing? I need some blocks made real quick. Needs... You need a good meal soon. Huh. Where's Brand? He is busy working. He's going to continue working. Actually, Brand... Rokes is the best worker. Where is he at? He probably came back here and built something, didn't he? He's getting a fine meal. Okay, so Brand, how about you do this job? And Rokes, as soon as you're done, you're going to get out there and build much faster than Bran will. So you come and finish this one. Actually, can you bring... No, there are no granite blocks left. Okay. Alright. Dwayne is sleeping. Eric is sleeping. Oh, we have... Uh... Bran was on his way back. We do have someone to trade with. Brand. Okay, you're bringing in a block. Great. Maybe you're bringing it in for Dwayne. We'll see. But if you could drop that right there and go talk to Bringa. Let's see what Bringa's up to. Still sleeping. Michael went to bed. And Ronnie is playing horseshoes. Kathra is cleaning. After she brings in yet one more granite chunk. Got to keep everybody doing their thing. I was going to click on Klaus. All right, now, what do we have? They're willing to buy some of our stuff. Marble Club has how much of a wallop? How do we tell? Max hit points is not it. I need to know, what, blunt damage or something like that? Market value, sell, price, melee damage, 11. Cooldown, over 3.5. Compared to a spear, only damage of 7. Compared to... I was hoping I'd get a chance to compare it to a gladius or something. Apparently not. So that looks fairly decent. Now, that's a normal. Good. How does a good compare? Does it change? It does not. Same rating. Okay, so the good, normal, superior, what have you, must just change its value, rather than its ability to do damage. That sounds reasonable. So let's get rid of these guys here. That's a good 78. There's a good. And a steel. So it's two clubs. We'll keep those two. Spears, no, we'll toss those. And herbal medicines. Still have that one that is worth more than all the rest. We will take all of your components. Thank you very much. And we will sell you a whole bunch of chickens. Alright, so chick six. There's one up, so that must mean six years old? Six... Five days. What is the six, then? So if I sell... I'm only selling one, so it's not six of them. Just one of them. Maybe it's right on the on the divider between five and six days. A hair. Don't really need it. We'll sell that one, too. Uh, chick mail. Oh, that's... That's their name. Chick number six. Chick number three. Okay. Okay. That makes more sense. Get rid of all of these. So we have a hen and a rooster. We'll keep the hen and the rooster. We've got four chick ones. Well, that's a little confusing. Maybe they're all born at the same time. 
Okay, so hen one, rooster one. We'll keep them. Two and one. This, we still have a lot of years on them if we, uh, if nothing eats them. Boomalope two. That is our insurance. They have boomalopes to sell. We're looking at about 1,200 silver there. Do we want to buy another boomalope? Or do we want to just wait and hope we tame our own? Hmm. They're all the same price, despite age. I think we will buy one as backup insurance to our one that's left. It gives us two boomalopes. Just in case we get another infestation a lot sooner than I'm guessing. So, did I miss anything up here? I did not. So, we're coming down to the bottom. And these are the rest of our pets, which we are not getting rid of. Okay. So, they owe us, we owe them, 96 because of the boomalope. So, are we done? We don't want to buy any herbals. There are no foods of any kind. There's no steel, plasteel, gold, any of that sort of thing. No granite blocks. All right, that's the deal. And pause. We didn't buy anything that needs to be hauled in, right? Right, we just bought a boomalope. Animals. Boomalope 2 and boomalope 1 now. Okay. So with that, Dwayne is sleeping. Brand... Snuck away from me. You go and work here. And Ronnie, how about you continue to haul in more of these. And Vapa, you're trying to garden. Can you... Let's see if we've got everything here. Uh, we need 30 more steel there. We need 100 more steel there. 100 more, 100 more. Okay. So, Vapa... Actually, first of all, Klaus or Ronnie. Since they walk faster. What do we have? Brand. Ronnie, we've already assigned. So it doesn't show, does it? There we go. And Klaus. I'm sure you're here. I'm just not seeing you. Work. Klaus, you're in the middle. There you are. And you are hauling potatoes to stockpile eight. Okay, I'm not going to worry about food right now. So let's have you haul steel to that. And Vapa, yeah, I'll have you do one as well. You can do that one. Kathra is working on bringing those in. Everybody's got to work today. And work very specifically. Meals are actually doing pretty good on meals. Let's see how he's doing. Alright, he's doing a good job of slamming these out. These potatoes, 78 out of 100, 78 out of 100. We still have the red 40 out of 100, so they're still here. We may have to find some way to dump those someday if we run out of space in here. Okay, I'm going to stop you right there. Let's have you haul steel to this guy. How are we doing on steel? We still have quite a bit. How are you doing? You're fine. Alright, Taskmaster. Master. Taskmaster can't talk. Searching for anybody who's not working. Nettie, you are doing what now? Hauling granite 20 blocks to granite door. No, 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 no. You're hauling 20 blocks to granite wall. Thank you. Ronnie's sneaking away. She... She thinks she's going to bed. She's in mild pain. Needs. You're not that far off. Let's risk one more trip. You're not a power conduit. You're a Ronnie. Okay, let's get you to haul this one in. Then you can go to bed. There's Flash, whom I really wish someday could be set to... Oh, you're not going to be able to haul. Okay. So you're too wild to be able to train by a, a, 
uh, skill level of 10, apparently. All right, everybody's kind of up, grabbing dinner, grabbing breakfast, grabbing lunch. It's noon. Michael's in bed for the day. Dwayne was the night owl. He was supposed to sleep during the day, too. Hmm. Okay, Cathra is now cleaning again. Let's get you to haul. Cannot. Cannot. Alright, that's all done. Any materials left? Nothing there. How about here? No. Everything is reserved. Okay. Just leave you alone. How about now? No. 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 Alright, gotta wait for everybody to drop off their goods. Until then, actually, Dwayne, where are you? Right there. You are stone cutting. Oh, the blocks are all landing out here instead. Okay, then let's set this guy to a slightly less than critical. So they will go here when this isn't available from now on. Okay, rokes. You are hauling steel. Yeah, that's probably the best plan. Vapa, can you as well? Yeah, haul some more steel there. Nettie is hauling steel to sandbags. Okay. So you guys are done. Rabbit, you're bringing your load in. Good. Everybody's going to walk past uh, Fuzzy Wuzzy down here. They're going to roll their 20-sided dice each time and and uh, see how they fare. All right, Dwayne is working hard there. And as soon as he makes his first load, Slate he should show up at the bottom now, underneath the marble. That was a meow. That was a very distinct meow. I don't recall owning a cat. No. What the heck was that? What makes a meow sound that isn't a cat? <laughs> Do you guys hear that? Okay, I'll right, we'll go for it. Ronnie is ready for her next treatment. May as well get that done quickly and get her going again. So, Rabbit is over here. He thinks he's playing horseshoes. Let's get Ronnie taken care of first. Alright, Dwayne just dropped something off. Alright, give me a builder. Get me a builder. Or a hauler. Kathra, you can. Can you just bring... Not a constructor. So... Work. Kathra. No, she didn't get her fours. Let's do that. Now, you'll never be doing those. Hunt. I guess that's all the fours you get are just repairing construction. Okay. So, in that case, Cathara. Boy, I lost you. There you are. Come on over and haul these stones. She, she won't actually build it, but she'll just drop them off and leave. Leaving the builders to uh, be free to just build. Dwayne is grabbing more of those. Actually, Klaus, if he was up, it'd be great for him to haul these in and save uh, Dwayne's steps. You guys are all done. Oh, we do have uh, components out there to bring in. Rabbit's busy. Catherine's busy. Rokes and Vapa and Nettie were all bringing stuff in. Okay, so you are getting more steel. Catherine's bringing all of the the stone blocks that we had available. Good. By now, Dwayne should be done with his next batch. You're real close. There he is. There's Ronnie, who's hauling a marble chunk. Nope. Now, she is building that wall. <laughs> Bring all the rest of those marble or uh, granite blocks in. Wayne is going to get another one. Well, oiled machine we are. There's something I forgot to do last time. Temperature vent. We need to be able to vent through these hallways. Like that. 
And I won't worry about this one. We're venting through there. This is going to go away eventually. We didn't get a chance to finish. We did. No, right here. So that's all got to be one, two, three, four, and a wall. Yeah, that's all got to be taken out. And I know I'm getting distracted here, but there's a couple other projects I didn't get done. Cathra is cleaning. How about you haul one of these in to over there? Save Dwayne some steps. Ronnie's eating. Rokes is grabbing components that are just sitting out here. Oh, great. Eric, playing horseshoes. He's not getting a lot of fun in building, is he? Work. Who gets enjoyment? Nettie does. Rokes does. Eric actually does. Very much so. Burning passion for construction. Okay. You can... Uh, can you build me that? You're heading for components. Okay. Alright. I'm thinking Dwayne just dropped some more off. Cathra can do that. And then... She can bring more blocks over to this one, while Dwayne can not go after the one he thought he was going after, and he can go after that one. Okay. Who's over here? Eric is over here getting components. Klaus is sleeping. Brand is sleeping. Dwayne. Michael needs a break. Needs. His joy is low. But, he gets joy from mining. Where to? Fuzzy Wuzzy's down here now. Let's send him back on this side. That should give Fuzzy Wuzzy plenty of room to track down a squirrel or something out here. I don't know. We're going to have to really keep an eye on that situation. He's halfway there. And I am more than halfway. Is it 40 minutes or 35 into this episode already? Wow. It would be nice to be able to do shorter episodes because the the uh, the time that it takes to edit and render and whatnot is so much uh, faster. I could do more episodes. But it is so difficult to even get into the episode in less than 40 minutes. I feel like I'm finally getting my, my groove going here, and suddenly, poor alert mood, huh? Ronnie. So Ronnie needs to sleep. Okay, that's fine. Did I set up? I didn't. I wanted to experiment to figure out what to do here. Did that get turned off? It did not. Ooh, that was close. Off, Eric, off. I got that right, right? Designate to have power toggled. They're actually active. Okay, now they're off. So, they didn't consider this to be an enemy. That's interesting. Huh. Okay, so you guys are doing that. Pause again. Who's where? Klaus. Consuming a fine meal, we'll let you do that. Rabbit is f feeding Trebo, that's fine. Catherine is hauling. Eric playing chess, but you get enjoyment from construction. You just aren't willing to accept that. Work on this one. Go grab more steel. Okay. Maybe the walking isn't actually helping them. It's only the actual construction, this part right here. The welding. That's possible, because he spent a lot of his time walking. Let's check that out. Eric needs. Yeah, your joy is not going up, even though you're officially on a construction duty. You have to actually be constructing. I see. Okay. So, Rokes, you are consuming a fine meal. Bran, you are hauling granite blocks. Good job. Is there anybody... Dwayne is getting more. I think that's the only granite blocks on the map right now. Okay. Alright, who else is doing what? Rabbit is hauling boar meat. No, you are 
what? You're about done. You can haul some wood. Meals are still fine. And with that, I'd say it's time to order structure granite. Fill in that one. We'll wait on this one. It may be that we don't actually pop this can this episode. I don't know. Now, can I do a little experiment here? Brand, go here. Rokes, you don't have a weapon. Eric, you do. So, Eric, you drop off your load, and we're going to try to shoot Brand. <laughs> Let's hope I can pause him in time. Okay, hop out and stop. All right, so if you draft would shoot Brand, how do we read this? Eric is selected. Close. Let's select Brand and look here. Combat. Social. How do we look at cover? Alright, that's not working. Alright, we'll go to Eric. Shooting. Oh, maybe it's a pop-up of some kind like that. Aiming time. Neely. There is a way to see the cover. And I use it so seldom that I always forget how it's done. Maybe it's the opposite. Brand, shoot, Eric. Oops, I did that wrong. Brand, shoot, Eric. Now, do you have any sense of cover in here? I just don't see it. Now, the block itself is not going to tell me anything. I don't know. It's there somewhere. I just forget how to find it. So you undraft. You undraft. Nobody shoot anybody, okay? Thank you. But, Eric, can you construct that? And Brand, can you... What? Construct that. Rabbit, you are cooking a fine meal. Yeah, that's fine. But on your way, bring in this rice. Bring in these strawberries. Thank you. And Klaus, you are picking up rice for stockpile. That's great. Kathra, you're cleaning dirt, which is needed. But this stuff is rotting. Gotta get it in. All that in for me. Michael is mining granite. and He is so much fun doing that. But he didn't make it into here. That's what happened. That's right. That is all the steel we have left now. But it's toward the end of the day for him. No, he's actually doing fine. Let's coax him out to here. And... Make sure that he makes it this time. Need to set some beds in there. There's an unowned bed. Okay. Alright, so Michael's still selected. Let's have you go to this one now. And that should get that done. And still keep you a little ways away from Fuzzy Wuzzy here. A little ways thinking that's better than this but not by much especially if he's the only animal there's a turtle squirrel well there's two closer targets hopefully it's enough all right you guys are set for what remind me any okay eric built himself in 
Yes, he did. Cancel. Eric, wake up. Come on, wake up, wake up. Thank you. Go to sleep. <laughs> Build this wall. Actually, yeah. Build this wall before you do. But do it from the outside, okay? No! Okay. Try this again. Uh, I have to do this skillfully here. Haul it. Stop. Build it. And build it. And build it from outside. Alright. That's ready to go. This is sealed. We need to build granite wall this one. And this one next. And that one is already built. Okay. And that's a complete structure. I'm not sure it's going to work, but that's the complete structure in my mind. Break down steel improvised turret. Jump two. Okay. With the components that are not rotting. Okay, that's fine. All right, then. Everybody's just kind of chilling out here. What's the chance I can get you, Bran, uh, potato plant, to haul these pieces in? Will you bring in... No, uh, you're only going to bring four? Oh, that's all we have left. Now, let's do this differently. No, not deconstruct. Brand, go here. Now that you're closer to these blocks, can you build this for me? Apparently... Oh, we're on draft. Never mind. Okay. Grab that. And you're going to take just five. So you're only going to be able to bring... Hmm. I could defeat that by setting up a quick little stockpile here. Now, I won't... Well, it will work. Okay. With... Alright, let's do it this way. So we've got more out here anyway in case we need to alter a plan really quick. Storage... Critical, clear all. Not the chunks, but the building materials. Where is that? Raw resources? Yeah, stone blocks. And not just stone blocks, but granite. Okay. So if I told you to haul... I can't tell you to haul. This is critical, is that why? This is important. Okay, draft, undraft, haul granite blocks. Is that not granite? Hmm. Okay, you stop there. Go over here. He'll only respond to uh, something that's nearby. Undraft, let's try this again. There we go. Grab the 70. Then when you get to here, grab the 5, which becomes the 75. There we go. Now everything is out here. Then come out tomorrow and finish these last two projects and be done. Dwayne is stone cutting. Ronnie is doing what she's doing. She's doing stone. I wish she would concentrate on food. Okay, so that's there. Where are we? 50 minutes? I think this episode is the big setup. I don't see us... I can see one episode right here once this thing gets popped. Visitors. Traders? We have a trader. Okay. Keep that one in mind. Brand is building. And tell you what, lay that one out first. Then lay this one out. Rainy thunderstorm. Oh, great. 
All the rain, too. I'll tell you what. I think the emergency is for the most part done. Let's turn hunting back on for all of those pigs. Which... I hardly see any. That's all that's left now. Hunt. Alright, we'll do that. There's more up there, but that's these are the ones by the boomalopes. I turned them off so I can get Eric and Ronnie available to help out, but we're pretty much there. Brand is now going to continue building as long as there's building materials already in place, which everything looks like is loaded now. And this did build with a roof. Oh, we don't really want that, do we? No roof zone. I don't think we want that. I don't think so. I think I want this heat to escape. With, with these last two, I'd say we are uh, pretty much done and ready. Okay, Klaus, let's manually set you to go there. Ronnie's gonna go hunt. Who else is out and about? Nettie, playing horseshoes. Why don't you grab some of those? Dwayne, you've done a great job. Bring in some, uh, some hay grass, please. Sleeping. Michael is having a ball down here. And for that matter, Klaus is there. Unowned. Okay. We want to mine out. We're about done with this episode, but while I'm thinking of it, that goes away. Those go away. Those go away. That goes away. Ooh. Big thump. And that deconstructs. Okay. Klaus, your new bedroom is right here. Set owner... Klaus. What'd you get, by the way? You got a superior bed out of that. Woohoo! Klaus is meditating. Okay. So with that, I'm going to tear these, tear these walls out, rebuild them, which means I can get conduit in them. And I realized as I was editing the last one that this failed not because there's conduit on the other side, but because it's a stone wall rather than a constructed wall. So... This will go here, and it may still go here. I don't know how it's going to interact with the table. That needs to be done. This needs to be done, too. Let's do that in stone. I think we want to stone all of this. Like that, and deconstruct that. So that the multi-analyzer can drop in here next time. But with that, I think I have done enough stuff, except for this. One more thing. Security. We'll go ahead and go in with the sandbags. Right there. And we'll assign somebody who can walk. Klaus, is it you? Need food, but I think you can pull this off. How about you go and put all the steel out there in the sandbags? You've got a good, fast walk. Where is... Ronnie's hunting. Nettie, I don't see. Not sleeping. There you are. You are frozen. You are hauling berries to stockpile. So you have found nothing else to build. Actually, you know what? Let's reverse that then. Klaus. You stand down and do whatever you want. And Nettie can do this because she can stay there and build it. That's better. So that's our plan for next time. Get everybody in position. Turn that on. Everybody else is over here. See what happens. Cathra wants to be the one to lob in frag grenades, so we might consider that. We did buy some. Did we ever get them put away where they won't fall apart, though? Did anybody equip them? Okay, we bought frag grenades from somebody... One of the, uh, the caravans. I don't know where we were standing when that happened. But with everybody set to 
calling. I'm hoping that somebody did. We didn't get this guy. You know, I'm still not going to end this episode. Where's Brand? I need you to tell me if there's anything going on here, because next episode I will be starting over there, and I'll forget all about it. Wild Boar Revenge. Oh, I cannot get a break. Jump to location. Nettie shot this guy, and he said, Uh-uh. I'd take you down. There you go. All right. <laughs> Fran, what, the, what you got over here? Actually, we'll start right there. Yeah, we'll do that next episode. So, this has been Noble Rambler. Thank you guys for watching. And I'm going to jump right in and continue recording. So, any comments left on this video will not be read until after next one. But while I'm here and in the mood, let's take down a poison ship. Catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.